Romine, left wing, top of the key to Dotson, in the post to DeBoer, going right at Agula, throws up a shot off the window, good. Claire DeBoer drops home the first full goal of the game for the Bison, and it's four to three. McGurk shot block, recovered by DeBoer, outside, Romine for three, and she buries it. Romine is shooting it at 42% from three point range, timeout Boston U, a little over two minutes gone by in the first. Inbound for the Bison underneath the Terrier hoop. McGurk gets it into Romine. Shelby pulls up over Agbula and swishes it home. Two for three start for Shelby Romine. Five points for her and an 8-4 lead for the Bison. Moving around the perimeter, Dotson attacking the glass, finds McGurk, driving baseline underneath the hoop. Bounce pass off to Craig, off the window and good. Excellent patience and ball movement shown there by the Bison, 10-6, they lead. Romine dribbles out to the perimeter with 20 to shoot. Dotson, top of the key. She'll take the shot over Agbula and hit the three. Dotson, who shoots it at just 23% from outside, hits the Bison's first field goal in over 11 minutes, and we're tied at 20. Romine, deep three, right wing. Answers. Big hoop there for Shelby Romine. Second three of the game. She's two for two from outside, 24-23. 2.10 to go here in the first half as Romine backs things out. Around a high screen, pulls up from the elbow, off the mark, long rebound still loose on the floor, and O'Brien comes up with it for the Bison. Wide open three, Romine, yes! She is unconscious from three-point range since late January. It's 26-24. Might go a long way to deciding the victor. Dotson thinks about pulling up over Agbula and said finds McGurk. Over to Dotson, three-pointer from the right wings, left short. Gets her own offense, rebound in the putback. Great hustle play there by Audrey Dotson, 30 to 25, largest lead of the game for Bucknell. 19 to shoot on this possession, two and a half gone by in the second half. Tyler Craig underneath the hoop, gets caught, but throws up a runner that goes in, not even hitting the glass. Wild shot by Craig, and it's 32-29. DeBoer inbounds to McGurk. O'Brien in the game now for Bucknell. Another good three-point shooter against this zone. Romine finds O'Brien in the post to Swart. Backing down Agbula. Left hand off the glass and good. Sine Swart, her first field goal. Largest lead of the day for Bucknell. 40 to 34. Romine. Deep three, right wing over Hope. It's short, offensive rebound to Bourne, and she's able to save it from going out of bounds and goes so right to O'Brien who hits the baseline jumper. Bucknell is out rebounding BU 46-33 and a timeout called by Boston University. 9.20 to go, second half. The Terriers continue to sit in their zone, trying to protect McKendrick and Egbula with their foul trouble. Deep three, O'Brien, bang! First three of the game for Claire Marie, nine point lead for Bucknell. McGurk, right wing, feeds the post again to Sine, going right at Agbula into a double team, fits a pass off to DeBoer and she scores. Great recognition there by Sine Swart, 47-38. Agbula backing down Swart, turnaround jump hook, leaves it short, rebound O'Brien. Off and running on the Bison, into the lane, off the glass and good for Clamory. 49-38, largest lead of the day. Scannell driving baseline, double team, pick and pop with Abula. Elbow jumper, no good. Rebound Romine and she'll look to push. Two on two with DeBoer. Romine fakes the pass, goes up, no foul. Offensive rebound to Boer. Put back, yes. Double double for Claire DeBoer, 54-42. Crowd starts to clap here at Soika. They can taste the victory. Can't exactly waste the rest of the clock. There's a 10 second differential between shot and game. O'Brien driving baseline past Latham. Left hand off the window. And that'll put a bow on this one. 62-48, Bucknell in front.